Does a five minute dinner sound good to you? Three ingredients and a little upfront planning will get you in and out of the kitchen fast. For uncomplicated recipes for busy beginners, go ahead and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to get notified of new videos every Thursday. So whenever you are making beans in the crock pot, it is like five minutes, it's super simple. What you're gonna need is you're going to use a can of Rotel, these um, ham pieces, a pound of beans, and a carton of chicken broth. This is 32 ounces. The very first thing that you're gonna do is rinse your beans. We have to soak them overnight. That's the only bad thing about um, beans in the crock pot is that they, it does require overnight soaking. So basically you're just gonna kinda dump them out in your hand. On occasion, there will be um, little pebbles or clumps of mud or something that makes its way into the beans. But really, we're just going to loosely look at those and then run some water over them and they're gonna soak overnight. I've filled the crock pot halfway full of water. It seems like overkill, but these are going to um, plump up and get nice and juicy so that we can cook them in the crock pot tomorrow. Okay, good morning. I am about to head off to work, but before I go, I wanted to um, go ahead and put my beans on in the crock pot so dinner is ready when I get home. So I have rinsed and drained the beans. Actually, in the reverse, I have drained and then rinsed the beans. And now I am going to go ahead and throw everything in the crock pot. I mean, this is so simple, guys. I have my can of Rotel. Ooh. Farmland, smoked spiral ham, slices, and pieces. We have one pound of beans. I'm going to use half of this package. It is probably around a pound of meat as well. Or half. It's already cut in pieces. It's got all the fat in there. It's going to cook. Ham is a little bit salty by nature, so I'm not gonna add any salt or spices or anything to this other than the Rotel, my ham pieces, and my chicken broth. Don't forget to recycle. Okay, everything's in there. We're going to stir it up. If your um, liquid is not covering the um, Top of the beans you can top that off I've got another uh, container of um, chicken broth in the fridge because that one was or in the pantry that one was already open a little bit so I'm gonna go ahead and fill that in you're gonna want to cover your beans and ham with the chicken broth and put the lid on it on low and cook it for about eight hours and by the time you get home from work dinner is done okay so I got a rock and roll I'm already late for work so I will see you guys tonight hey guys so I forgot to tell you, um, this spiral ham pieces that we used in our recipe earlier, it, um, if you put it in a Ziploc bag and put it in the freezer, it can um, stay there for, I don't know, four or five months. It's fine. But if you go ahead and buy, um, whenever you're picking up your groceries, if you pick up an extra can of chicken broth and an extra can of Rotel and have that in your pantry, whenever you have nothing to cook and I don't know, maybe you're snowed in, like is about to happen today. But you can grab the ham out of the freezer. You can put on a pot of beans and not have a care in the world or something like that. Okay, so I am home from work and the crock pot has been going about eight or nine hours. And all you have to do now is really give it a good stir and salt and pepper to taste and dinner is done. It's five minutes, yo. If you like that video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. And if you want more quick weeknight dinners, go ahead and check out these videos.